Hello, welcome to State of Affairs. It's a Friday. We are focusing on constituencies. Tonight, it's time for Constituency Watch, and we are turning our radar on the Shai Osudoku constituency in the greater Accra region. If you follow the NDC primaries, it was a very interesting turnout last year. A widow came out victorious. Tonight, she'll be joining us to tell us exactly what her plan was and how she managed to implement that plan to make Make her work would that be the same plan for her as we head to the polls in uh, November or December uh, this year well we'll be finding out pretty soon she'll be joined by Emmanuel Marte Tete who will be running on the ticket of the PPP and also Stephen Nene Oyote who is running on the ticket of the new patriotic party that seat is actually a safe seat for the NDC but can the NPP turn things around for the first time? Well, we'll be finding out very soon when the three of them join us on the set tonight. It's a very interesting constituency. If you're a constituent or a keen observer of that constituency, well, we'd like to know your thoughts and uh, what you make of the candidates and events that have panned out in the last few months there. Use the hashtag State of Affairs across all social media platforms. I'll be too happy to read them to you. Of course, later also, we'll be checking out what Beneficent has to say as we count down to the elections. And if you haven't downloaded uh, the election hub app yet well I would actually plead with you to do that because um it's a very interesting app. It gives you up-to-date information about everything you need to know as far as this election is concerned. I'm actually checking out how many days more it is to the polls. And of course, if you download the app on the iOS or uh, Android uh, um, devices, you will find uh, the countdown there. 135 days, 5 hours, 52 minutes and one second more to the election. So make sure you download the app and also check out the um, opinion poll and participate as well. Let's take a look at some stories. You know very well that tomorrow, uh, June 25, is World Vetiligo Day, a day set to build global awareness about vetiligo, a frequent and often disfiguring skin disease that has negative social and psychological impact on patients. State of Affairs reporter Alice Ayete spoke to a patient suffering, or a lady who actually has that uh, uh, skin problem who shared sad stories on how stigmatization is affecting her causing many to attempt suicide this is just a teaser to an extensive story on vitiligo which will be aired on monday tomorrow saturday 25th june is world vitiligo day a day set aside worldwide to create awareness about vitiligo a skin condition and i have here with me enam someone who has been living with this skin condition how old are you and when did you get this were you born with it well actually i wasn't born with uh, vitiligo uh, i'm now 24 years old i was 12 years old when the whole thing started up it, it came just a patch on my left arm. And as I was growing up, it kept on spreading. So that was how come the whole thing started. Recently, just recently, uh, I'm at the consultant room and this patient just came. The patient is, was actually uh, an old lady. She just came and she was just screaming, Jesus, Jesus, you, you look like a caricature or something. I, I was like, okay. At that instant, I felt I feel very bad, but I, I, I just, but I, I was just like, okay, this is it. Let me just breathe, take a breather. And then I, I, I started talking to the lady that she should just calm down. It's, it's no witchcraft. It's no caricature. It's no zombie person that she's saying. It's just a skin. So she should just relax. And th that was so emotional. As a country, we are not really embracing uh, individuals living with vitiligo. We people normally stigmatize because in a case where you have to board a bus and then a person will be like, okay, I don't want to sit beside you. And that person wouldn't even board the bus with you. And it falls, it's a very terrible situation. So as a country, I don't think people are really uh, embracing the skin with like, or people are not really showing support to individuals living with vitiligo. Do you have a boyfriend? Yes, I do. I do have a boyfriend. Okay. And, and he doesn't 
no. care about? No, no. Actually, I'm not bothered about what people say about me because that's their business. I have my life to live. I, um, I, I believe self-esteem is something that when you express your confidence, no one can intimidate you. So I'm not bothered about what the opposite says, says or what another fellow says about me. It's all about me. It's all about my self-esteem. It's all about what I aimed doing. So basically, the opposite sex or what they say doesn't bother me at all. All right, so that was just a teaser from Alice Aite's report. Find out uh, what doctors have to say, dermatologists have to say about that skin condition when she brings us that extensive report on Monday on State of Affairs. Well, um, we move on to other stories. The management of Samba Foods Limited, a small and medium-scale enterprise, has disclosed that despite strides made by the company over the years, particularly after being listed on the stock market, high cost of utilities, is having a toll on the company. Uh, management of the company has proposed that stakeholders in the agri sector should help in training farmers on good farming practices to be able to improve on the raw materials or foodstuff produced for food processing companies. Uh, this came up at Samba Foods' first annual general meeting at Tema after being listed on the stock market. The first annual general meeting brought together the board of the company, its shareholders, and some representatives of the Ghana Stock Exchange. The meeting was to discuss reports of directors and auditors together with the company's financial statements for the year 2015. The occasion was also used to appoint two new directors and an auditor for the company. Speaking at the event, the board chairman of Samba Foods, Charles Daku, said the company has grown steadily over the years, expressing optimism that it will yield better results in the coming years with the importation of a customized granite processing plant. We have grown into one of the respectable and growth-oriented SME companies in Ghana, employing more people and serving global clients like KFC, Cocoa Processing Company, several export companies in US, Australia, etc. The managing director of the company, Leticia Osafwado, mentioned a number of accomplishments by her company despite the harsh economic environment. One of our main goals is to become a leading food processing and preservation company in the country and the sub region as a whole. The initiative of listing under the gas has helped to us to rebrand, acquire state-of-the-art plant and machinery, and re reorganize our operations to increase our production capacity and capabilities, which will translate into positive returns on our investment in the shortest possible time. Speaking in an interview with State of Affairs, Mrs. Osafuado proposed that government and other stakeholders in the agriculture sector train farmers on how to best grow raw materials or foodstuff for food processing and exportation. We've had our fair share of challenges before we even decided to go on the guts. But since we went on the market, the significant uh, challenge that we've had is the... Um, utility like everybody um, then um, the raw materials because we use only raw materials that are certified you know especially with the um, granite paste the granites we can only use granites with um, the least levels of aflatoxins and uh, this is what we are trying to educate up uh, suppliers to also train their farmers <clears throat> to be able to supply the kind of quality that we, uh, we, we require. Time now to do our countdown to the elections. Download the EIB Election Hub app. And remember, tomorrow, uh, EIB is partnering Rotary uh, International Ghana for the National Peace Summit at the Kofi Annan International Peace um, Center, Peacekeeping Center in Teshinungwa. Um, of course, you should keep your tabs on all the EIB uh, networks to keep yourself updated on what exactly what the candidates would have to say as far as peace is concerned during, uh, in fact, before, during and after the elections. Here is Ben Epson.
EIB Election Hub. Expect more. We'll give it a population of the ethnic groups above 500,000. This is a request. We are here to save you, viewers. This is your request. Have you saw this? This is to give you an idea in color. We'll just take you through. In no particular order, these are the um, ethnic groups with populations above 500,000. And I'll go through it slowly, so you just take your pen and paper. This is extracted from the 2010 population census. Should we start from head or tail? Okay, let's start from the tail. So Nankasi Talensi Grusi, that's far, far. 582,000 plus. Kusasi, 522,000 plus. Dagomba, a little over 1 million. Kokomba, 828,000 plus. Ga, nearly 744,000. Dangbe, that is Adan Shai Krobo, Osudoku, that a little over 1 million. Achim, 765,000 plus. Equapim, 624,000 plus. Fanti, nearly 2.7 million. Ewe, 3.31 million. And Ashanti, 3.8 million. So now you have an idea of, so the guns, you have an idea of the Dangbe, the Fanti, and these have been put in the public domain to show the ethnic groups above 500,000. EIB Election Hub. Expect more. Okay, so let me just remind you before I take a break that your Sunday evenings will not be the same because beginning this Sunday at 7 p.m., the man is back on your screens, Kweku Sechi Ado. Everybody loves him. And he's back with the lounge, which airs on Star FM. It's actually going on live now. But the first edition for TV is ready on Sunday, 7 p.m. You should tune in. He has drinks with very interesting people. And it's a very, very good conversation you don't want to miss. So stay tuned for the Sunday's edition. We'll be back with our candidates for the Shai Usudoku constituency. Please stay with us. Welcome back. Now, here is a brief report on the Shai Usudoku constituency by Armstrong Alugwe. The Shai Osudoku constituency is one of the seven constituencies in the Dangme district considered a safe seat for the ruling NDC. In 2012, the incumbent David Tete Asuming of the NDC pulled 18,089, representing 58.99%. Daniel Christian Dugan of the NPP pulled 6,991, representing 22.80%. Emmanuel Mate Tete of the PPP pulled 5,069, representing 16.53%, with Solomon Na of the CPP pulling 517, 
representing 1.69%. 80% of the working class are in the private and informal sectors. A May 2015 edition of the Ghana Poverty Mapping Report, a document prepared by the Ghana Statistical Service, revealed that the district is the poorest in the Greater Accra region. It has a population of more than 51,913 with 22 electoral areas. The constituency has major developmental challenges such as bad road networks, poor school infrastructure, teenage pregnancy, lack of credit facilities for the market women and a high unemployment rate. Some market women could not hide their anger at the state of the market. When it is raining season here, it's, it's, it's a pity because it's like flood. You can't sell, people don't buy, and we need more shades around. This all for the MPs, please and please again, if you come on power, please. We are market women, and without us, you can't eat. We want gravels in the market, nice ones of course, and the shades. And we want our market to be paved for us. Not to me I <laughs> Roads from Shai Osudoku that link Ashaiman to Afienya, Dodowa and Doyumu are particularly bad due to the lack of job opportunities in the constituency. Some youth say they are left with no option than to engage in Okada. We all know that it's illegal business, but since this is the only way that we can apply to sustain our life. Some of us are students, we do apply this, we do go through this, earn some kind of money to pay our school fees and other things. Yeah. Through this one, some of us were able to get lanterns and other things out of it. So maybe if a government to abolish this business for us, it will worry us. I quite remember there was some years ago, somewhere like four years ago, some of us do still. We do pay people containers and other things, simply because there's no job avenue in the town. The State of Affairs team came across parliamentarians of Shai Osudoku constituency, a group of young people in the constituency. They blamed the member of parliament, David Tete Assuming, for the lack of development in the area. For the past 12 years, we have uh, a steam car just here, and the stones are very uh, here. They, they, they take the stones from here to Kumasi, when you from here going to Afeja, you see the road, very bad. Even the township, the roads from, leaking from here to Boom, very bad. For the past 12 years, we've not seen any development. It's very bad. The any time you see politicians coming to the people, the time we want to vote. And it's very bad. We see actions speak up rather than worse. When the MP who we putting into a uh, stool, started working. He may not put money in your pocket first, but what he is going to bring to town for the youth to get a lot of work to do, we are going to be happy to even give him more chance for the next time. But if those things uh, are not coming, we are not going to give him the next chance. So if that is what we are all going to do, then we can, we can change them because when they, uh, when they are coming, they come with stress. But when they are in stool, they forget us because we are here with them and they forgot us immediately. So when their message is coming and they are not working on the message that they brought to us first, then we are also going to put them away. For about uh, 12 years now, uh, I'm not appealed at all about the member of parliament. So the local youth parliamentarians make their mind one. And we say no. 
we have pushed this man to parliament there for a long time, about 12 years now. We haven't seen anything. He's not been coming down to visit us. Even we started with him here at this parliament. We all enjoy here, we eat together, we do everything one here. As he read to parliament, we haven't been passing here at all. The constituency, however, has an ultra modern hospital. If you compare this hospital with the old one where we were, it's like comparing apples and mangoes. It is a 120 bed capacity hospital. And the good news here is that it is expandable to a 300 bed capacity hospital without necessarily touching on the infrastructure, physical infrastructure. This hospital has come to help us embark on our crusade against maternal mortality. Maternal mortality is one thing that the Chair of Local District Hospital, aka Dodoa Hospital, does not joke with. Over the years, we have tackle maternal mortality head on collision. We put in place policies and measures that are practicable, that can prevent a woman from dying. I particularly want to say a big thank you to His Excellency President John Dramani Mahama. back to the show. Tonight we're focusing on the Shai Osudoku constituency in the greater Accra region. Uh, not long ago you saw a piece on the constituency highlighting the challenges in that constituency. But what a beautiful hospital uh, they have uh, in Dodua. Well, uh, my guests tonight are Emmanuel Mate Tete. He's running on the tickets of the PPP. Yeah. It's good to have you here in the studio. And also Stephen Nene Oyote. He's running on the ticket of the New Patriotic Party, and we're expecting Akwele Oklu, uh, who just won the primaries for the NDC, and hopefully she shows up just in time to join the discussion. But in the meantime, you're both welcome to the show. Thank you. I'll start with you, uh, the New Patriotic Party. Stephen, um, I mean, this may be a very arrogant question, very rude question, but I will still ask. Do you not think, and I would expect you to answer that question as well, do you not think you're probably wasting your time you know, contesting the seat. It's a safe seat for the NDC. Uh, are you uh, spending money, you're spending time, or you're hoping that the wheels of uh, 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 the, the, the constituency will change to sink or run for you? Anava, I um, thank you very much for your question. And before I comment on that, let me say good evening to our cherished viewers. I mean, especially to our party chairman. Good the good people of Shao Sudoku going to see. Thank you. Ah, uh, <laughs> but. Yes. Uh, this is your question, I don't know, and I'm, I'm, I'm happy you started by saying yes to provoke me. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, if you look at uh, Stephen, Stephen is an uh, indigenous, I mean, a local boy from the constituency. Okay. And I'm, I don't, don't forget, I mean, I've, been an assembly member before. Okay. Yes, for the first time I won. No wonder uh, at this age I uh, was able to go to the throne to be the primary candidate over there. Okay. And I'm, I'm, I'm sure of, 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 of victory. You know, don't forget uh, Shao Sudo Constituency is a stronghold of the NDC. Uh -huh. Indeed, I believe there's going to be a history. I believe Sivinoyote is going to make a history because 
the good people of the constituency need a change. They are all crying and yearning for a change. And I believe that change will definitely come. Mm. And it will come from me, I believe, because okay. of the good plans I have for the constituency. Fantastic. We'll look at your plans a bit later. But how about you, Emmanuel? Well, <clears throat> you don't think you you're wasting much. your time and well, your resources? Well, thank you very much for this question. Uh, let me seize the opportunity to say good evening to the good people of Shai Sudoku, mm. especially uh, my party chairman, Ferguson Acheku, and then uh, the world executives. Now, it's good you ask this question, but then uh, change is the only constant thing in, in life. And the good people of Shao Sudoku uh, seem to be tired of, like, let me see, the way things are going these days. And they are poised to bring a change. Now, I keep on telling them that you can't continue to do the same thing all the time and expect a different result. And I think they are buying into it. You're very philosophical, aren't you? Yeah, terribly. <laughs> I see. They are buying into it. They are buying into the things you're saying. Yeah. Uh, how, do you know, how do you know they are buying? Because if change is coming, they might look on the, on the left and they're seeing the well, new patriotic party candidate. Yeah. Uh, what makes you think they'll give you the nod ahead of him? Well, I keep on telling them that this time around, the way uh, we hardly see development in our area. Your constituency is considered one of the, the poorest, poorest yeah. in the greater Accra region. Which is not fair. And it is because of the way we vote. I keep How on do telling. you vote? Yeah, they vote on party lines. They fail, and this is for them. So, and this is our party. So, whether they perform or not, we will still go for it. But all of us are feeling the brunt of that. But if you look at that hospital that has been built in your constituency, mm -hmm. the Dodua Hospital, yeah. it is a massive hospital. Well, I, I don't know what it used to be like before they moved into that ultra-modern facility. It was a clinic. It was a clinic. A clinic and somebody elevated it. That's uh, so it's the not MPP a, a, elevated, it, elevated it to a hospital okay. before th this new one. Okay, mm -hmm. now tell, what was the state of the hospital when it was elevated from a clinic? It was a hospital. Okay, what was the state? Well, uh, let me see, this one... When I say state, I'm talking about facilities. Yeah, the facility. Mm -hmm. this, this one, I must uh, uh, be frank with you, this one is superb. This one is superb? Yeah. So you don't think they will retain the NDC? Well... Because <laughs> healthcare delivery healthcare, will improve massively? Healthcare alone mm -hmm. cannot... Uh, convince many of health is wealth yeah but that one alone there are other issues okay. like employment our road networks if you're not in healthy fact, how do you get a job no 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 we have in fact we have been faithful to the ndc government all this while mm. and have they been faithful to you uh, no okay so you can't that's, say that's the hospital yeah so you can't say only this hospital can okay you know. Stephen, is that the only thing um, you can point to as the, 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 the one thing the NDC has done for your constituency in the um, last how many years? 24 years. In the last 24, 24 years, years. Yeah. this is the major development you have sure. seen. Yeah. That's pathetic, isn't it? Yeah. Is, is, that, is that fair? You, you mean to say that apart from this hospital, the NDC has neglected, the NDC government has neglected the constituency? And now I think I want to correct a point here. The, the um, nice edifice that you saw, it wasn't uh, government funded, but it was a, a UK. I mean, uh, it was a UK project. Okay. You understand? I, just, I just want to set on record. And the issue is that yes, indeed, if you look at the hospital, it's cool. Yes, because it is more than cool. Oh, but. Uh, we are hearing a whole lot of things about the, the, the material used in 
in building that. What, 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 what is wrong with the material? Oh, yes, you see, um, 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 it should be something that uh, will last because I'm, 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 I've been hearing from uh, some experts that the people are complaining about the material used. But Actually, if, we, if, if you, you care so much about healthcare delivery and you are sick, and I hear maternal mortality was such, a, was such an issue in the constituency, uh, pregnant women were dying constantly, and you have a facility of the sort there, and we, I, I, I listened to the medical superintendent, nowhere did he uh, speak to the issue of materials used. He, he looked very excited. Na, 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 but you see, the issue is that if you look at, the, you know, this means that we have two disease hospitals in the constituency. Lucky Let me see the district. Okay. Yes, but I think this one is about 120 bed capacity. Right. The initial one. And apparently uh, it can be Kufo, expanded to 200. The Kufo also. is no 100 bed capacity. So we are saying that at least being a new district hospital, mm -hmm. at least the, the bed or the capacity need to be Increased. a little more exactly. But it's expandable. No. Oh, 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 yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. To oh, yes. 200. You said 200. The doctor said 300. Oh, which one? The doctor's doing oh, propaganda? That's 200. not fair to the doctor. The but, doctor no, no, says it's I 300. Said, well, I'm going with his figure. Okay, fine. Because he's the medical <laughs> we, superintendent. We of also the had. We also had. Are you a contractor? <laughs> well. <laughs> <laughs> you're not a contractor. Uh, but we had. The superintendent said. Well. You're, 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 you're basing your argument on hearsay. But this is a man who is responsible for the hospital, and well, he says it can be expanded to 300 beds. Well, somebody can also even okay, so say yeah, no, 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 but see, can uh, we, we were talking about infrastructure here, okay. and there in the, the hospital came in. Uh, don't forget, uh, during our time in the MPPJ president, Gufo, right. you know, initially we were having this Ganata at the Usa when you go, I don't know what that. The secondary school? Yeah, the secondary yes, school. I'll come to schools later. Well. I want us to focus on health first. Okay. Oh, okay, so let's look okay, at health. We'll look okay. at the other areas. Uh, okay. Let's look at health. Would you say this hospital has been a blessing uh, uh, to the people? Oh, yes, yeah, I would say yes. I would say yes. But you see, the hospital we are talking about mm. is an edifice and an infrastructure that is fixed there. Now, you ask yourself mm. about the people, their accessibility. When I'm, I talk about accessibility, not like they wouldn't get access to the hospital, but affordability. Well, uh, uh, National health insurance works. Oh, but you know national no, health insurance is not no working. I don't know that. I know national oh. health insurance is working. I, I don't know. Unless, I, I know of course, it's working. We Unless you, are doing, you two are doing propaganda. Very no. To go to I'm, the hospital. We are real. I'm I don't know. I don't, I don't, no, no. Yes. We are real. No. And I, you see, so yes, the building is there, yes. For now, you can see it's very nice. Mm -hmm. In the eyes, when you see, yes, indeed, <laughs> very nice. But the issue is that the people over there, mm -hmm. what about them going to the affordability? Are they able to afford? When they go to the hospital, I'm, I'm sure they're able to afford. I, I don't think so. With the old one, the doctor would have mentioned it. Oh, because oh, he looked, so he, he, he and, looked, and, he looked uh, uh, superfluously excited. Oh, the, oh. Doctor, the, doctor, <laughs> the, doctor, <laughs> the doctor, the doctor must sing his master's voice. No, the doctor that cannot sing any oh, master's song well, yes, because now, the doctor does not work for well, NDC. You see, you see, uh, no, I, I, I don't, I don't even want us to, mm. go, to okay. go into that. But so you're that, saying that, that the people in the constituency are unable to afford health care at the hospital? Exactly. Because the NHIS, according to you two... Oh, I've been, I've been oh. there on several occasions. To I've do been, a, to access health care. Exactly. People even I mean, come to... to the some, people uh, come to us, like you, know, uh -huh. you know, they complain because, you they know, complain. They the come to us. Is, it's, it's not, not working. working. So help us. To the extent that even you don't, You don't think that because you're politicians and because you want no, to... No, no, no. It's, it's like, real. Our people details. are listening to us. We go to us. No, you you can also go there and verify for yourself. You can just go and find out. You can go there and so I think this is a, is, a, is, a, is, a, is, a, is a general problem. We cannot uh, only assign to do do well or something, but it's really a general problem. So what they are saying I'm not yes, sure indeed. about that one. That oh, yes. A yeah, problem. but Nana, but yes. I don't know. I, hope, I, I believe you are friends. I mean, mm. you are, yeah, you can just... You can just yeah, them. nobody has told and me that they've gone <laughs> to the hospital and the NHIS wasn't working. There are, of course, challenges with the NHIS. It doesn't mean that the system has collapsed. It's no, we are not saying it's not this, working. No, you're saying it's not working. What do you say it's not working? It means we are not saying it's not working. say it's not working? Did you say it has collapsed? Ah, but if it's not working, what does it mean? Oh, we didn't say it's You say it's not working. Something cannot be working, but it doesn't mean that that thing is collapsed. 
it's collapsed. So, so what, what is the state of the NHIS then? If it hasn't collapsed, what is it? It's just not working. It's no. like a caricature, a skeleton. Stuff. Oh, it's just, it's just an Maybe it's, it's, it's a scarecrow. Let me. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> because when, when you mention, uh, don't you have a health insurance? Uh, what have you got? Say, oh, in Yejuma, it doesn't work. Because they are probably they buying into your propaganda. No, 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 no. Okay. They feed us with that. They feed you with the propaganda. It, not the, not necessarily propaganda, but they <laughs> feed us with, with Nanaba, the reality. Have you used the NHIS card before? Well, do I, you have one? No, I have one, but I have not used it before. So you cannot, uh, you know, you cannot ascertain the truth. But my relatives go to the hospital. They visit there and and I, eh, and, and I buy drugs. I buy. Oh, well, drugs. it doesn't cover all drugs. Well, but the basic, even the basic yeah, ones. of uh, three, uh, three CDs and it, uh, it cannot cover. It cannot have you used cover the about. card before? Oh yes. You were turned away. Oh yes. I when? mean, I do attend. Ah. Oh, just about uh, uh, just like to with my daddy. Uh -huh. Was at uh, the uh, hospital there, okay. and to the to the extent that buy medicine for three cities, the car can no uh, they were right sure. Are you absolutely sure of this? Seriously. Bed facility. There are even no, uh, you know, very very shocked. Very very, very shocked. Yeah. Did you rehearse your notes before coming? Oh no no no. <laughs> No, but we are talking about real issues. We are talking okay. about real issues. Real I mean, issues on the ground. You see, we are at the local they are yeah. listening to us. Yeah, yeah I would like to hear clean. from them. Exactly. What you think? Are they telling me the truth tonight that the NHIS uh, cards uh, uh, refuse to be accepted at the Dodua Hospital? I'd like to know from all of you if you're watching and you're in that yeah, constituency. Well. Okay, so we'll put the health sector on, on hold. No, but apart from the, the hospital. Um, I mean, uh, let's talk about access to the hospital. Uh, the, the roads that lead to the hospital, are they any yeah. good? Yeah, they, they've constructed a new one. Okay. A new so so it's, it's good news. It's good. It's good. Stephen? Yeah, I think this is good. The, it's the good. road? Yeah. yeah. Okay. But, but uh, I don't know, I was there and mm. you see the more tree there, I don't know the drainage system. You know, do do we have a drainage system. And you have a drainage problem. Yeah, that's the road to the yeah, that's hospital. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. You see, and we have the problem with our drainage system, sorry. And mm -hmm. if, you, if you look at uh, the, the drains, so we, where we have a mortuary, whereby, you know, when I talk about a mortuary, I believe you, you understand. I know, look a mortuary. The, exactly. But, but yeah. well, it has not even started. It, it has not started, not but if off. you look at the, the drainage system, you see there's a problem with it. Because when they start, uh, I mean, operating it, if you are not, they've, they've not, they've not moved into it. They've not moved into the the the, the morgue. new, the morgue. The no, new, I mean the new, the, the new morgue. No, the new, the whole uh, uh, hospital. They haven't no. moved into it. No, 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 no. The hospital has not been used. No, 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 no. So why are you telling me that they go there and they turn away? No, I mean the the, the existing one. I, I was referring to the new one. Oh, so okay. it's not being used as yet. No. Yeah, they 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 are yet to. Move they are yet to it. move it. Yeah. Okay. They even right. invited, so you are referring they even, to... They even invited me to contribute towards the movement. Well, that's I, good. Uh -huh. uh, I mean, well, if you want to be MP, you should also be contributing. Well, Everyone must problem. contribute. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, wait. So what you were referring to earlier was the other hospital, the 100-bed facility you mentioned. Yeah. Uh, the one constructed under President Gopal. Exactly. That they, they no longer take no, the energy. No, it was expanded. It was expanded yeah, from a clinic. Construction. It was yeah. upgraded. Upgraded, yeah. From a clinic to, to a, a hospital. hospital yeah. So there was some construction, major yeah. construction, oh, yes, that yeah, by yeah, President Foucault, yeah, yeah. to a 100-bed facility. Yes. And you're saying that that facility at, at present um, does not take the NHIS card. Hmm? You see, Is no, Nana, Nana ba, let, let's, let's get the, the issue clear. clear. You see... We, we are, You're I'm not saying, me. No. no, I'm not saying they are not accepting the card. Mm -hmm. What I'm saying is that the card is not working. What, it doesn't what? cover a, a lot of is things. It one, one, is it acceptance is different from uh, its workability. You have to get so what So it I'm is saying. not working. Exactly. They go there. And they buy drugs. They, they buy right the there. drugs. Exactly. They, they pay for health care. Exactly. Okay. okay. You see, that's what So the are card saying. is irrelevant. Exactly. That's basically well, what exactly. you're saying. Because to the extent that three CDs... Maybe it's just like a scale. The card cannot cover three CDs. Mm -hmm. Then, then you, 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 you wonder. Okay, I will be talking to um, the doctor very soon. Um, the doctor we heard uh, pretty soon to to tell me if indeed um, the the card or I mean these allegations you are leveling uh, are really true.
But anyway, um, he'll be joining us on the phone pretty soon, and I'll get his name from uh, the gentleman who filed the report from your constituency. We're talking about the roads, and you said the road is beautiful. Yeah. But apart from the, the road that links uh, you know, to the hospital, you do have quite a terrible network of roads in the constituency. Yeah, that, that one. Okay, that you want to kick off? Oh, as for the road network, since the Pope was an altar boy, it had... Since the Pope was, was an altar boy? I'm telling you, it had ne <laughs> never been good. It had never been good. The entire... The entire road network. And you see, surprisingly... But it's we hard. Have, when you say no, entire have, road network, yeah. you just saw a beautiful asphalted road. Oh, that so, one... To the hospital. To the hospital. So it's, so it's actually not the entire road network. Oh, well, that is... Maybe a flash in the pan. It's yes. a flash in the yeah. pan, really. Yeah, we're talking about Dodoa to Ashama. Okay. Dodoa it's to bad? Afi. I think I saw that Ter it, it was terrible. completely horrible. Yeah. yeah, and then we're talking about uh, from Aikuma to uh, Doimu. Aikuma, yes. Aikuma, Aikuma to, to Doimu. Doimu Another ter terrible. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then the one that leads to the, the Osu, Osu, Osu Enclave. Okay. Osudoku. You know, we have two traditional areas, the Shai traditional area, and then, and then also the one that uh, uh, leads to the Osu uh, enclave yeah. is also horrible. And you and haven't then seen in, any... In the interland, that one there, it, they are not motorable. Really? Especially, yeah, they are not. And you think that... Especially these... when, when it rains. Uh... Actually, Totally unmotorable. You think that these roads have not received any attention because no. the government is complacent. They know they, know they, they will win, still they will win, win the uh -huh, that's it. so there's that's no point. It. They don't care. Right. Stephen, is this something you you want to associate with? Nanaba, um, you see, as I'm speaking to you now, we are in a constituency whereby for the past, let me say, seven to eight so, years now. So, uh, which road is this? Well, I, I don't... This is in your constituency. Where, which, where is this? Well, yeah, no constituency. Yeah. yeah. I, 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 I don't even you don't know it. Do you know your constituency very well, then? Oh, oh no, I, unless I, we look see at some... it. Oh, you want a landmark? Then yeah, you know exactly uh -huh. where it is. Yeah. Because this is your constituency, so some roads are receiving. Um, In my constituency. Mm. Oh, I, I don't think. You haven't seen these. It's no, 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 the no, only no. road I know is under construction. So is the Ayukuma? Ayukuma, and that one, you can go and look for go and yourself. Look at it. Very bad. I it's, it's receiving like attention. About a week now. No, they, they, they so, somebody uh, uh, building there. Somebody uh, the, uh, uh, the bridges. Uh, it's only the bridges, and it's not motoral. Is it that you two are in grades? Oh, no, 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 madam. You see, let me let me tell you something. Okay. A family member of mine at Asebi. Mm -hmm. If you if you heard of the name or you know Asebi very well, uh, he was uh, electrocuted, but because of the road, the person had to die. Because when they because were on their way coming, access the hmm. hospital. Oh, Nanamba. You see, they were on their way coming. Then the car, the car got stuck in, in the in the muddy water, so they had to take oh, another no. second car. So by the time they brought the the car and they took the person to the hospital, the person was pronounced she had dead. Passed away. Exactly. So you see, what, what we are talking about now is not an I issue. That I have never we, seen. We, Golly. we, we need to like take it like because the the, the 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 president government is taking the people for, uh, for granted. For granted. Okay, but Be why do you, why why do you think that these roads? You say that they've been bad since the Pope was an altar boy. Let I like see. that line, by the way. I have to, I have to borrow it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. But why, why do you think that your roads are not being constructed? Because we've been told by this administration that road construction is one of their major, uh, you know, uh, points. One of their strong points. Uh -huh. They're, they're investing so, in the road sector a lot. You see, well, when, I, when I say it, mm -hmm. okay, uh, you may think because I'm a politician, okay? So I'm painting the government black or what have you. It is, but I'm saying that it is the duty of the media to go and... So you don't know this road too? No, 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 no. You don't know it? What? <laughs> this is not some phantom road which is in your constituency. <laughs> but it's an number. Yes. Yes, you see, and... <laughs> anyway, me, no, never mind. No, no, you see, let me, let me, I don't know, but... Let me see the opportunity to uh, I mean, thank uh, um, Dr. Kwesa White. And as I know, during their premise, mm -hmm. he tried in a way to pass some of the, the, the rules. Yes. Yeah. 
and I think I'm, I must commend him for, for, for that. Mm. Now, about that thing you are saying, I think it is it's somewhere a, a part of the patching of the road that the, the man tried to, to, to do. do. Uh -huh. But wow. I don't, we can't call this no, a, no, no, a construction no. because <laughs> you, you go I to heard, I heard that he did but something. But do you, like do, you, do you complain? Ha. Huh? I mean, not you two as politicians, but the, the, in the constituency. Because in that report, there was a group that called itself something parliamentarians. Yeah. Young parliamentarians exactly. or, or, or something of that yeah. sort. Do you, how far do your voices go? How far do the young people there protest? Look, the complaints, we've complained and complained and complained and complained. But... Apparently, like that said, road is actually going to Afienya. Oh? Going to Afienya? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Today, I was, I was, I was at... Uh, Afienya. You find her laughable? <laughs> oh, yes. Today, I was at um, Odumse. I was at... Um, uh, Afienya Road. Lado, are you? Gee, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, Afienya Road. I, I, I don't, don't know what to have seen. Exactly. I hear the construction started on Monday. Monday? Oh. Yeah. Monday. Just this Monday. Construction started on that road. So just you probably haven't plied that road ah, as yet. I, I'm telling you, I, I was just coming from Odumse and Fiancunya. You can call anybody there. Let's and then call, call them. Let them call him. Let them call me. I, I'm so sorry, but what is really happening? You mean from Afiyanya? Monday to just this uh, Monday. I shall, uh, don't do what to Afiyanya road. Yeah. That's, that's how what you showed on. on, on. Uh -huh. oh. in fact, you see, you see, you see that's how you see, the, from the, the Monday, people are just from, taking the for granted. <laughs> from, uh, and, say, and, and, and that, that's that, what, that thing started on Monday, just this Monday. Uh -huh. I must be fair. Uh, you haven't I've never, I've never so but I would have been, no, I would have been surprised. Mm. I would have been surprised, no. I'm telling you. Why would you be surprised? Because of the <laughs> terrible nature of that road. And that's it. Car. This no, one. no, no, this, this, no, no, this no, 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 this is not the Afenian road. It's not the Afenian road. No, 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 maybe. No, no, no. This is not the Afenian road. Really? Oh, no, 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 no. I see. I this is not the Afenian road. I hear it leads to Afenia. It leads to Afenia from Dodoa. It leads to Afenia. From Dodoa. Oh, you see, when, when we are talking about uh, the entry route to Afenia, uh -huh. you can either take Shy, Shy Hills. Shy Hills. Or Shy Hills. Or Anyone or still from. waiting for the doctor's uh, uh, call? Okay. Anyway, so you're saying that the roads are bad. Terrible. They haven't received any attention Terrible. apart from the one and that goes to the hospital. Yeah. And, and that one, and that one was a new one. Well, a new thing. And, and, and well, at least you have a good one. Yes, the, 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 painful the, the length of it, the length of, uh, the length of it is about some 300 uh, meters. So you think... Uh, oh, no, but do you know what? It's a flash in the You back. see, the, the, the painful aspect of this whole thing is that you see the quarry, the quarry over there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That we're using to construct other people's, other people's Yeah, yeah. If it wasn't yeah. exporting, yeah. it's coming yeah. from our... That, coming that, from will, that will lead to the we, next issue, jobs. Mm -hmm. Jobs. We, 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 the constituency... Owns that that quarry, but look at our roads. If okay, nothing so at all, it's not fair. But in a, 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 a good road to even go off, but they just taking it for granted. Yeah, it's, it's not fair at all. They have you understand? Fair. What what what? So this is what you are hoping to change. Exactly. If the constituency and decides to vote for either of you, yeah, you or you, definitely, definitely you, you, to, you, huh? You have to. You have to vote for <laughs> you, you. Yeah. but you wouldn't mind if he wins. No. Because you're looking for change anyway, and you wouldn't no, mind. No, not he necessarily. Wins. Any change, <laughs> yeah. It's the not people must, yeah. They must choose wisely, exactly. exactly. And it has to be you, exactly. exactly. And not him, exactly. What would you do differently? Well, uh, it's a long story. If I well, uh, or I should. Th say. There's a word called uh, summary. Well, okay. <laughs> now I've started. Uh, Let's say initiated a lot of projects mm -hmm. within the constituency. I have established schools. There's uh, the senior. You've senior. established schools. Yeah, two of them. Two schools. Yeah. Basic school. No, no, no. The, 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 is it? I was part of the founding members. Of which school? Of Hillview uh, Academy. You were a founding member. Yeah, Hillview. We mooted the idea. And then you mooted the idea. And then we. And you established it, it yeah. or some people established no, it? No, we did it. You and who? 
myself and then my colleagues, oh, the great. examiners. Okay. Yeah. Oh, great. Are you a teacher? Yeah, I'm a teacher. I oh, teach fantastic. at Ganata Senior High. Oh, fantastic. And then we established, we wanted to establish, the, this one is in the Shai enclave. Okay. We wanted to establish another one in the Usu. Okay. But we, uh, we had challenges with the acquisition of land. Mm. But then we had finished processing our documents and what have you. So we had no choice than to relocate. Okay. So the, sec the second one called uh, Unity International College, we relocated it to, uh, is it a uh, Frafraha? Mm. Adenta Frafraha. Yeah. Apart from that, I've created some jobs. So your plan will be to create some jobs. To create jobs through education. Through not the only construction education. Of schools, not mean. only education. Mm. And then uh, I've uh, put up this filling station. But the, 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 the MP company. hasn't been able to do anything. No, 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 no. He even hardly come to the constituency. Well, he's busy working for the constituency. Oh, so in Parliament House. So what about the development? Do you have to leave? Uh, development uh, in your constituency and he, he, he's lobbied for a major hospital for you oh <laughs> well you like only to that, underplay only that, the, only that the one. importance of that hospital only that one okay they have not been fair to uh, us uh, okay what's I, your plan uh, I never, Stephen, thank you, thank knowing very well that you cannot create jobs but you can lobby. no you can lobby yeah. I, no, but, but this uh, one is where it's my own creation. Self-help. Yeah. Initiation. Uh, yeah. If, Wonderful. If the central government cannot do something for you, our leaders must be able to do something. That's all. Some that's things. all we want. Exactly. Yeah. Nah, Everybody nah, nah, must help. Yeah. Yes. You see, my, 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 my brother is aware when we are talking about change and real change, then it comes with a new patriotic party because as you know, PPP, I mean, it's, it's adding up to, to, to the number and it's aware in the constituency. When we talk about so they're the insignificant. Issues. Oh yes, he's my very good brother. But they're insignificant. Exactly, and we are talking about <laughs> change. <laughs> okay. Then the, the, the change needs to come from a humble person, very exuberant, visionary, and that person is, is Stephen. He's not humble. No, I'm, I'm not saying. I'm, 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 I'm not saying he's not humble. <laughs> okay. Um, and about you, you do, do you know what I mean when we talk about our constituency, you know, like Stephen as a person. You know, have this uh, a company, Shabi Enterprise. Mm -hmm. Yes. What do you do? We, yeah, we are into shower gel, um, liquid soap, or it's Oh, nice. Then, you yes. produce it yourself? Yes, exactly. It's, it's a registered oh, nice. company. You produce yes. it in the constituency? Yeah, in the constituency. Yeah. You're not that. bringing it branded from China or something? Oh, no, no, no. no. We, we, we have the, 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 the factory at Afiena. Ah, wonderful. So have, yes, that and that's for you? Yes, exactly. Okay. Yes. Uh, I have a poultry farm too. We've, we've, engaged, uh, we've engaged a lot of the youth. That's really, I mean, it's really making, I mean, being very, very uh, fantastic. You see, so because the um, number, we, we realize that the constituency, it's if you look at the unemployment level among the, it's the terrible. youth, it's very, very, very serious. Yeah. It's not peculiar to your constituency. It's wow. nationwide. All over, yeah. Yeah. And, and then he's talking a, about, a, he's talking about his establishment. Okay. So you've you created some yeah, jobs. How many jobs you, yes. have you? Uh, you you, you let told me, tell me about, wait, let him learn. Okay. I'll come to you. Oh, for, for, for when you talk about management, I mean the factory 15, then we have factory hands mm -hmm. to then do that, go for the sales. We can get some drivers and or other people. So let me say roughly, considering marketing and other stuff, I mean, around 300 people. And we so are basically what you're saying is that you've got the expertise oh, yes, to exactly. help create Ex jobs exactly. for the people until central government exactly. comes because, in. Exactly. Because, you see, in Anaba, I mean, our constituency has suffered from the shackles of poverty. And if, 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 if you... How does it make you feel that you, you walk around and people say that you are the poorest constituency? Oh, yes, it's embarrassing. People want that. Sometimes people it's embarrassing. So tell them, shall soon Because you have resources. Exactly. Yeah. That's how easy you become both of the wildlife. I mean, the exactly. they don't do a forest. I mean, yes, they they exactly. Forest. You know, you go to my home. They don't do a forest. Because we have they a training camp, the Volu Training Center. That, I mean, if it to be converted to a school, which I'm working on it, uh, to become a nursing training institution, yeah. you just uh, uh, look at the number of people that will engage in terms of employment, then educational wise. Sometimes you mention South Sudoku and people ask you whether it's in the Northern region. Or whatever. People are not even, they don't even know. And you tell them it's a great talent. Say, wow, are you sure? 
<laughs> I see. Oh, yes, exactly. Then they, they're just ignorant. Oh, no, no. It's not as if your constituency is off the map. No, no, I'm not saying it's off the map. Uh -huh. But you see, it's just a place that people, people wonder. Sometimes we ask them, say, I eat in Dodua. Because when you talk about the Usudugu area, very, very terrible. I wish one day with your team yeah, you could have to go there. Really you on. must go there. Okay. Yeah, he's talking about his achievements. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, the only bank we have there. GN Bank. No, the it's only bank that we used to have, the Rural Bank. Okay. It's in terrible crisis. All right. Now, uh, it took my lobby mm -hmm. uh, to see Dr. Endo, my boss. Mm -hmm. uh, then I had to force him to bring the GM bank there. So you have a bank now? Yeah. So that's the only one. bank? Wait, yeah, that's the only international bank there now. So you have a rural bank? Yeah, we have And a now rural you have GN Bank? GN Bank. And then... Why don't I you have, have banks? Because you're not economically vibrant. The yes, banks cool. may yes, be running out of money. Yeah, yeah exactly, bank. exactly. Uh -huh. mm. So now, and then uh, I've put up a golf station. You're very rich. Hey, and the golf station is going to oil. It's, yeah, uh, yeah. So very, you cannot what put you up, say, you yes, put up golf station. No, no, I mean a filling station. It, it's so, got oil, wait, so my OMC <laughs> is Goyle. Your OMC? They, they supply me the oil. So, wait, no, no. Uh, Goyle, so, wait, 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 let me wait let's get it right. Wait, mm. you will land. Wait, you said you put up a filling station. Yeah. What's the name of your filling station? Uh, Mattel's, that's the company is Mattel's Oil and Gas. That's Mattel's Oil, Oil and, and Gas. gas company. So, Goyle supplies supply. you. Yes. Okay, so you cannot put up a filling station. Exactly. No, no, sorry. Okay. Okay. So, it's called Mattel's. Yeah, Mattel's Oil and Gas company. Where do you get the money from? <laughs> You're a teacher. Through savings. Yeah, through savings. Through savings. Yeah. Wow, you can save as a teacher and build a yeah, filling yeah. station. Yeah. And then, uh, oh, I this, am so uh, washing, useless. Yeah, washing beans uh -huh. and what have you. Uh -huh. Then I have a cattle ranch. You have a cattle run. Yeah. And, then, and you have a washing bay. Yeah, and then uh, we talk about... You're very this industrious. Month. Yeah, we're talking about farms. Is this true? Stephen, are you That's aware? No, no, but... Uh, Wait, are let you me, aware? Let me, I he, mean, just, he, he, just, he, just, he just spoke about him building a uh, 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 goil. And no, 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 it's not, it's not no, no, it was a slip. Yeah, it's oh, okay. it, was a, it was a slip. I, I established Mattel's Oil and Gas. Mattel's Oil, oil and, and Gas. Do you know the spelling station he talks about? Yeah, but he said he put it now. I was like, hey, Goyo. No, it was a slip. It was a slip. It's been a slip. I'm not aware. I know it's you been have. Been a, but do you know the Mattel's Oil and Gas? I'm not aware of any company. How about the Cattle Ranch? No, he has been buying food. The Cattle Ranch. He has been buying food for me. The cattle ranch. Oh, I'm not aware, but Maybe you see, um, 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 and then he was just talking about building uh, <laughs> coil, and then coil no, he, I was like, wow. Goyle produces. No, 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 no. Goyle supplies but, him. No, but no, no, there's no filling station like Martin something. No, no, no. no, no. Matt Hills. Matt Hills. Hills. No, no. You can call anybody from my constituency. What are they No, we have. So he's lying. Oh uh, yes. I mean, you let. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Let me set the record straight. Is it in business? It, do you sell fuel? Yeah, I Where sell. Exactly I'm an oil dealer. dealer. You're an oil dealer. Yeah. Nice. Where okay. exactly is it? It's at Dodua Town. So do you know it? No, no. You see, you um, see. Um, let me. Let, I'm let, getting let me. No, no. Let, you. let me. Let me. Okay. I know his problem. What is his problem? His problem is. His problem is. Now. Because, Goyle supplies me. They brand my station with their colors. So when you come there, you see Goyle. But a document in my documents, in my documentations, you see Mattel's oil, oil and gas, and gas. And gas stroke Goyle, stroke Dodua Goyle. Okay. Exactly. But the, the whole thing is branded Goyle. Right. Exactly. But, I, but I, they only supply me. I sell. I didn't give them their is, money. Is that the contract? That's, that's what the contract yeah, is. That's I mean, the once they're supplying you with oil, they then brand your feelings. Exactly. The, because I'm okay. selling I, their I, product. I, 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 I'm I, selling I, I, their product. You're selling their product. If I should enter into uh, 
something. An agreement with, with Allied Shell. Oil Shell. or Shell, they, they will brand, brand you. Yeah, that's all. It makes sense. Exactly. Are you satisfied now, Stephen? Oh, uh, I was only, I mean, I mean, surprised when my... So you don't, know he, like, you don't know he's an oil dealer, a big-time yeah, oil dealer in Dodua. He built to go oil and I was oh, like... No, no, oh, no, no. You are being I'll, mischievous. Oh, no, no, no. no, 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 no don't no, be no, mischievous. I'm, oh, my, my brother... But you, 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 you've been buying... You've been buying... He buys from you. He from you. He buys from you. Oil is Ghana oil. Dr. Pesa White has been buying for for all the for parliamentary that candidate that he go, I was like, hey, no, wow. no, no, well, well, <laughs> but we've, cor we've corrected that. Yeah, it's been, <laughs> the truth has been established. Yeah. Yeah, he's explained that one. Okay, um, the, the lady. So we have to. Akwele Oklu, uh, who's running on the ticket, that's her name, right? Uh, running on the ticket of the NDC. Unfortunately, yeah. she cannot be here because she's apparently has just been taken ill. Uh, that's why she couldn't make it. Uh, she just sent a very lengthy message explaining her situation. So we should understand her. Okay. But um, you don't think she's going to win the seat? Well, let's leave it well, within the... I mean, you, 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 let, you, you can me, feel the yeah. pressure from her, can't you? Well, I can also feel... They can also feel, feel some pressure from me. Okay, but do you feel her pressure? Well, I don't feel her pressure. I mean, this is a woman who came from nowhere. And I don't, that is, she did so that, well. That is a fight within the... The NDC. Yeah, that's all. Okay, but she's a woman. You don't think... I mean, you, you've had MPs mm -hmm. who, you say, haven't done anything for the constituency. Yeah. And um, she probably is aware that the MPs haven't done anything but, for the constituency. But the people have bought into my message that you cannot continue to do the same thing all the time and expect a different Okay, this is why I like so, to play the gender card. You don't think yeah. a woman is in a better position to deliver far better than you men in the constituency? Um, Nana, but thank you. Let me mm. you don't agree. the opportunity no. to I don't I mean, agree. congratulate her. Mm. I mean, in fact, I mean, she did very well because mm. if you look at somebody with not that uh, political experience, yeah. I mean, she did very well, but... Like I say, doctor did very well, but let me cooperate him too. But um, Nanaba, you know, as an opposition, I wouldn't say I would talk from the, I mean, the opposition point of view, but a whole lot of um, things happened. I would just say I wish her well. But Nanaba, the issue is that if you look at the problems of Charles Sudoku now, I think that there, there, should, there should be a change. Because don't forget that for the past 24 years. They're getting a change. Yes. The and, change is and, a woman. And, yes, and the change shouldn't be... Because she's a woman. That, yes, okay. no, not because she's a, a, not because a she's woman, a... not a lady. Mm. So you should be given that opportunity because what we reach now with the problems, I don't think we need... I mean, the, the woman to... Just okay, let me take things. some messages and then we can go on. Yeah. Uh, Basta says there's an exactly galore on state of affairs tonight. Well, the two of you, I think it's probably the overused word tonight. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> anyway, um, Evans Obu Tete says, I'm ashamed for, of where I'm coming from because our leaders have misled us in this constituency. Uh, Simon Nyako says, NHIS works at all uh, accredited facilities in the constituency. Okay. Um, do Joan um, Amega is asking if you two are siblings. Okay. Uh, before I go on to the rest of the messages, uh, let's join the doctor we saw in the story. I quite didn't get the name very well, uh, but he's going to clarify a few of the issues you raised here that the NHIS cards um, are not working. They are not received. You can't buy any drugs. We didn't say receiving, yeah. we said they are not working. They are not working. Exactly. Okay, Dr. Kennedy. Um, Dr. Kennedy Brighton, thanks for joining. Yeah. Thanks for joining me tonight. Um, you listen to the two candidates. Uh, well, I, we had a program in the hospital, mm -hmm. and um, I was called and told that I was on. Um, that I was on TV. Yeah, okay. but I'm still in the hospital. I'm still in the hospital. All right. Now, um, they they did raise some concerns that the hospital. Yeah. They say that the NHIS cards do not work. At your hospital, is this true? Well, I think that this is a this is it's a sh it's shocking news to me to hear this. It's you know sometimes I think that we should try to call a spade and say, and then pick facts. The National Health Insurance Scheme was piloted in Dodua. 
It was piloted in this hospital. It was piloted in this district. And that presently, the ratio of card holding attendance to non MHI card holding attendance is about 80 is to 20. 8 is to 2. So it is shocking and extremely amazing that people would see it on TV and lie blatantly to the whole nation that the MHI card is unacceptable in the Shai Osudoku District Hospital. I am surprised, I am amazed, and I feel greatly disappointed. Okay. Um, so what you're saying basically is that it is a, a palpable lie when these two gentlemen, gentlemen say that the cards are not working in your hospital. So people show up and they are buying drugs with the NHIS cards. Hello. Can you hear me, Dr. Brighton? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, so I'm saying that we basically... Have, you see, let me tell you one thing. There okay. are drugs that are on the NHIS scheme, and there are drugs that are not on the NHIS. If your condition, your illness, demands that you are given a particular drug, that drug that you must be given is independent of whether you are a card-bearing member of the NHIS or not. It is treatment that you must be given. So there are some people that will demand certain drugs, okay. and you have to write for them. All right. Thank you very much, Thank Dr. You. Kennedy Kofi Brightson. He's a medical director for the Shai Osudoku uh, Hospital, and he has made it very clear that the cards work in the hospital, and he says the ratio actually stands at 80 to 20, basically 8 to 2 in, um, you know, for a bias, for those, the cards that really work at the hospital. Well, so the two of you lied. And so you see, Why would you lie to you me see, no. that see, the cards look, do not work? You see, He's in charge of the hospital, Nanama, and he you says see, the cards no, you see, work. Nanama. I don't see. Okay, fine. Okay. Uh, I wish you could do this uh, uh, nice thing and you go, go to the ground and then... But there are people tweeting from your constituency who well, say that the cards work. Madam, you see, <laughs> and your question, and now by the question that you are and going, you, go and you find talk out about uh, acceptance, who, that's what you talked about. Workability. I'm, I'm, no, Work, I'm not saying the card is not accepted. Yeah, indeed, when you are going to the hospital... You carry your card. You carry your card. But Before you go for folder, no. they, 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 he was not talking in reference to accept acceptability. No, you are talking about it's not working. No, I he mean, he was talking. He was speaking to the issue of it working. No, you see, no, and the, he the, says the, the ratio issue, stands at eight. No, 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 but you see, let me tell you something. Let me let me tell. You. I think the the, the question, uh, the issue you asked him was about the acceptance. No, I'm not saying the card is not being accepted. Uh, we are not saying. I think I clarified that exactly. earlier. That and the that cards records are, need to be straight. But that's what he's straight. saying. He's saying no, that see? it's 80 20. When he says 80 20, he's not talking about acceptance. He's talking about it working, the card working. Yes, uh -huh. so when you talk about uh, how the card is working or whether the card is working or not, it's about if you look at the, 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 the leverage, for example, then how to, come? The, to the extent that somebody will go, how come I uh, took my to The tune of three Ghana uh, medicine. Well, how would I know? Cannot cover. That's well, what you are talking fine. about. But I'm and there. I, I, and I'm I believe this, this issue is not is not pertaining to only to only um, our, uh, our hospital. But it's a problem. It's a problem. In generality, over. you understand. It's a problem so you said the record, the, the record straight. But but it, I mean, you 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 are telling me today that people have been telling you that the, the cards are not working. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. The, when they go the, there, the man, the man responsible for health care. No, he delivery. was talking about acceptability. No, he was talking about workability, and the, that is where he put the ratio across. Eighty twenty definitely is not about acceptance. I mean, if you're accepting it, you're 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 making sure that the people are getting yeah, health care. Exactly. But when Basically, we talk about its workability, it's uh, the, the, the semantics. What then, you're doing then, is just semantics. Then how come? Oh, how come? How what? come? Patients buy their drugs. Well, you heard him that the NHIS does not cover every drug. It was loud and clear. <laughs> so and this is information. Well, this is information that everyone we know, knows. No, we, no, we know you that. You know that. <laughs> uh -huh. So why are you sitting on TV lying no, to no, me? No, no, they should come out clearly. 
Oh, none of our those. None of our place. Those I think the, the, the word lying is. No, it's, it's, it's too. It's too so you're not lying to me. No, no, no. You're misleading me. I'm not misleading us. No, no, no. no, 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 no. Please, Anaba. Go to the ground mm. and then find out things for yourself. So the doctor did, actually misled us then? Well, or he that's, has different, that's, no, that's different his own, statistics. Damn, that's his own. Okay, own we have just a minute or so to go. Stephen, I'll come to you first. Tell your constituents why they should vote for you and not him or the NDC. Oh, um, thank you um, very much. Um, let me say good evening to the uh, good people of uh, Shao Sudoku. You can speak your language, you know. Okay, thank you. My plan is to say that I will not be able to do it. I will not be able to do it. My plan is to say that I will not be able to do it. 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 Kone manye ke kwa koto neba. Ili ankuwe cha usu duku wange ni inti samini ya nese ne ni ni hiyangu. Si leadership pe. Nene wa sumo. Alright. Kwa nungu nake ngwa ilo makwame pe. Thank you. Kuna mfiwa si. Nechake muna ala eba. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Alright, your turn now. Make it very brief. Oh, okay. Inyi mime, nge cha usu duku. Look into the camera. Yeah, cha usu duku. Inda anye si samini ya. Can have your support, then you can have all this while. Can't be any deal. The full look, you cannot continue to do the same thing all the time and expect a different result. And you have a chucky, you know, him. It's like end this year. What people will pay end this year? Then I MP saw me, I will work in the EGO. You can call him a track record. Okay. All right. Thank you. They shouldn't vote for him. <laughs> I think I understood that one. <laughs> he knows he is just helping me. You know, he's helping you, right? Exactly. He's going to get you the vote. Thank you very much. Um, Stephen Nene Oyote yeah. is running on the ticket of the New Patriotic Party. If you've been yeah. convinced by uh, his submissions tonight, you should vote for him in the elections coming up. And then that's Emmanuel Mate Tete from the PPP. If yeah. you're convinced as exactly. well, you should vote for him. Unfortunately, Akwele Oklu could not make it because she's not uh, feeling too well this evening. But yeah, woman power. I'm not campaigning for her, but yeah, we want more women in parliament. Oh, no, but no. not in Shao Sudoku. Not in Shao Sudoku for now. <laughs> <laughs> All yeah. right, thank you very much <laughs> for your you time. Too. Pleasure you having too. you here. Okay. We'll see you uh, on Monday. Have a beautiful weekend.